everybody and Merry Christmas to everybody watching. I hope you all a happy and safe holiday with a new year approaching. We all certainly have new goals that we would love to accomplish, let alone a change in our lives that we continue to stay safe and healthy come the new year. I do want to give a big thanks to the WWE family for presenting us another episode of WWE SmackDown, but this time our channel has not done a SmackDown recap before, but we are going to try it out and make a Raw recap and SmackDown recap each week. So without further ado, let's jump into a Christmas special of Friday Night SmackDown. The holiday special opens up with the WWE Universal Champion Roman Reigns as he is set to face Kevin Owens to take him on as he actually just beat Kevin Owens six days ago at TLC. Retaining that Universal Championship, Kevin Owens still won a redemption after a dirty loss at said TLC pay-per-view. But, of course, coming to Roman's aid tonight, Jimmy Uso handcuffing KO's hand to the steel cage, allowing Roman to slide out the door of the cage, retaining that Universal Championship. So, you know, Roman, he's got to look strong here still, um, with his brother certainly, or cousin certainly, by his side to help him win. I don't think Roman uh, certainly needs that to look strong, but I don't know. I'm a, he's still champion, and I can't say I'm, I'm pissed about that. Yeah, I'm happy about it, but if Kevin Owens won tonight, I think that would have been a big upset win, and I think it would have got people talking a little bit more. But next up was actually the SmackDown Women's Champions, Asuka and Charlotte Flair in the ring, as they are then interrupted by Bailey and Sasha Banks, then followed by Carmella and Bianca Belair as we are actually set for a triple threat match. Bailey and Carmella, Sasha and Bianca versus then Charlotte and Asuka. With Carmella first taking out Bailey as Charlotte hit a natural selection to Bianca for the win. I am happy to see Charlotte still victorious along with Asuka. I know Charlotte is a strong competitor, but with Asuka on her team, I am happy to see Asuka, you know, follow the reign with Charlotte Flair and kind of hype up her, her championship run. Next was the Street Profits. They were actually backstage hyping up Daniel Bryan's match tonight as Sami Zayn then interrupts as the Profits gift him with an I Was the Intercontinental Championship t-shirt to replace his I Am the Intercontinental Champion t-shirt after what they think is going to happen later tonight with his title match with Big E in a Lumberjack match. So I am excited to see what's going to happen. Next, Jey Uso was set to face Daniel Bryan, attacking him during Daniel's entrance, but Daniel did continue the match and was able to put away Jey for a massive win. Oh man, well, last was the main event as Big E defeats Sami Zayn in a lumberjack match to win. Yes, win that Intercontinental Championship as Sami actually tried to escape, but of course, the lumberjacks did not allow that, allowing Mr. Big E a huge win as he celebrates to close the show. Well, everyone, that was a quick but thorough smackdown in the books. I wish everyone a Merry Christmas and a Happy Holiday and a Happy New Year. So we'll see you guys Tuesday morning for, well, a brand new Monday Night Raw recap with our brand new setup that you guys do not want to miss. And I am excited. I will see you guys Tuesday. Peace out.